everybody. How y'all doing? Yeah. So, um, should we tell them how we met? Or sure. tell them some other story? No, you go right ahead there, baby. Really? Yeah. All right. So, John and I have been to Ramon's concerts, like standing Woo! right over here. Never met. I went to the Art Institute of Chicago, so did he. Never met. Lived around the corner, lived down on Market Street, never met. Right, growing up in Nashville. Probably stood next to each other in multiple concerts and multiple. parties, exit in. And multi-bobs. And multi-bobs. There yeah, too. Remember multi-bobs? Yep. Yeah. <laughs> so I moved back to Nashville after getting my master's degree, and it was around Christmas time. And I had a bottle of wine. And as you do, after you've had a bottle of wine, I got lonesome. Because there was nobody to put a tree up with. So what do you do when you're lonesome after having a whole bottle of wine right before Christmas? Anybody? Internet porn. Close. <laughs> I did have a computer nearby. And Craigslist. All right, so I get on Craigslist and I made a want ad. And it was about this long, and it was all of the things that I was looking for in a person to help me put up a Christmas tree. And then I went to bed. And then I got up, and had breakfast, you know, like you do, read the paper, had some coffee, uh, went to the computer. I had 135 replies. <laughs> Well, she was, it was one of the few listings that didn't say, I want a prince to come and take me away. It didn't say that. So it's, it's, no, it's no, uh, no word that, that it, you had all those responses no. like that. Well, it was funny because I was like, I'm a vegetarian and there's a guy with a deer hanging in a tree. I'm like, do you even read these things? So um, there was one, oh, so I shut it down immediately and, and kind of ran for my life. And then like a week later, I thought, oh, well, you know, I'll go through these things. <laughs> that guy. Yeah. Lucky me, man, I'll tell that? you what. Uh, Craigslist. Now is uh, 